we're going to hear from our next presenter, who is Mr. Jacob Lebo, who is an advisor of the Al Muscari Holding and Orbital Systems. And as you can see on your agenda, we're going to hear domestic water savings with showers of the future. So, Jacob, I'm sure the crowd wants to hear, is eager to hear what you have to say at this point. Uh, apologies from the very beginning. I do have to catch a flight back to Dubai on my way to Germany. Uh, the good thing is, though, I live in Abu Dhabi, so if anyone has any questions, happy to have a meeting here locally. I have left some business cards as well with the uh, organizers. Um, but again, thank you for the introduction. My name is Jacob Lebo. I am a representative of the Amaskari family in Abu Dhabi. We have a global and GCC partnership with Orbital Systems. Um, some of the things about orbital systems, as we'll demonstrate, is for you as uh, hotel operators, imagine the incredible savings that you could have. As designers, you'll have some incredible products to bring forth, thinking about green and renewable opportunities. And of course, thank you. As someone who likes to take showers, I think it's everyone, spending 45 minutes, an hour, in a very luxurious shower without having any guilt whatsoever. But first, some context. Lots of facts and figures. Our friends at Colliers also gave us some today, but I wanted everyone to focus along the bottom. 1.2 billion people are lacking clean drinking water. 2.5 do not have adequate sanitation. Another 4 billion are facing water scarcity. And these numbers are only accelerating. Now we as business leaders, we as decision makers, we can actually do something about this and provide a pretty good financial return on the back end. How does that work? Of course, through technology. Now, water savings, it's very hard to do because changing human behavior is not very likely when it comes to sacrificing convenience. So leveraging technology, and this is a photo of Orbital founder and CEO, Merdad Mandrubi. He is there at his NASA exchange program where he co-developed the technology, the filtration technology, that goes into the orbital shower system. So what Murdad and the team are doing up in Malmo, Stockholm, is expanding globally, which again, as the Muscari family, we're helping them do that, eventually opening offices in the United Arab Emirates to serve the local market. A little bit more about the context of the partnership and what that obviously means for you. Local sales and support with international technology. And what is this international technology? Thinking about it from a problem statement. We all know a conventional shower. We turn the water on, water runs, we wait for it to heat up, we're losing a lot of water, we're in the shower, we're lathering up, we step out of the spray, clean, fresh water being dropped out again. Imagine if we could recycle that shower in a closed loop system that both microfilters bacteria, nanofilters particulates, and creates water that is actually cleaner than what was intake and took into the system. This is the technology of orbital systems. The way that technology is applied is in currently three models. We have the panel model, the floor integrated model, and the cabin model. And I have some use cases of all of these coming forward. And again, forgive me, I'm going very fast. My car is waiting, so I will be available to take some questions afterwards. So as the technology is deployed in these systems, what are the benefits of that? Of course, tremendous water savings. We're talking 90% water savings. In Europe, when it, you have to do a lot of water heating, you're talking 80% power savings. And most importantly, as I mentioned, when it comes to changing human behavior and actually saving water, we're going to be increasing comfort. And we're increasing comfort in a very beautiful, elegant way that is up to, I would imagine, anyone's design standards of the interior designers, the architects here in the room. And this is where the floor integrated model works very well because it, it adapts to the designs that you have decided with your client. And it fits in very well in any type of a setting. You can see this is a locker room, but I think it's a very elegant example of how orbital systems can be deployed. 
So where is Orbital deployed? Mostly in the Nordics, Sweden, Denmark. We have a few systems in California. You can obviously see there's nothing on the region currently. However, we're getting ready to do demonstrations with Mazdar, as well as Dubai tourism. So anyone, when you're passing through Dubai or Abu Dhabi, please feel free to let me know. I'm happy to take you to the sites, let you experience a shower if you're feeling frisky. Talking about a couple use cases here as I'm wrapping up, certainly relevant to the hoteliers and the designers here in the room. You can see Meister Jan Hotel here in the Nordics. One of the top hotels in Sweden. They rely on high quality experience, both for installation and regarding the shower experience itself. I think pretty high praise, and one thing that the Orbital team is very, very focused on is creating, again, that wonderful experience when you turn on the shower and when you enjoy the shower. I know there's some government officials in the room. The municipality there in Malmo, Sweden, where the company is located. Working with the Orbital products there, they have, of course, environmental goals for 2020. They are deploying it throughout their assets that they maintain. The Swedish Armed Forces certainly has Armed Forces applications here in the region, but I think this example is very illustrative because it also can be applied to workers' camps, staff accommodation, things that are very unique to the challenges that we have here in the region. Just wrapping up, to discuss a little bit about the recognitions that Orbital has received. Um, lots of press from CNN to Forbes. We count the Skype founder, Nicholas Zinstrom, as one of our co-investors. Uh, different ministers, ambassador of Sweden into the UAE, minister of innovation in Sweden. These are all partners. These are all people that are proudly supporting what we're doing with Orbital Systems. Something that, of course, we're, again, very, very proud of. But the work is not done. As I mentioned, there are only a couple hundred units installed around the world. We're only adapting our technology to showers, which in the future we will be doing all domestic water. And as I mentioned at the beginning, four billion people without clean drinking water is a big, big problem that we all need to solve. So how are we solving it? A couple ways. More relevant here for some of the asset holders, perhaps. Different models when it comes to deploying the shower. The first one, of course, is an outright buying example, as I have here on the bottom. Supplier model, pay for the shower you gain all the savings. The one on top, I jokingly call it SaaS, shower as a service, small fee down, down uh, up front, and this monthly service fee is then on a performance contract where Orbital Systems and yourself, you share in the saving. This is made extra enticing because we have some arrangements with some of the best green lenders out of Europe to provide different levels of off-book financing uh, providing, again, low-cost, easily deployable solutions that can be gained payback periods. We've done 2.7 years in the UAE, and you can run contracts up 10 to 15 years, depending upon the desires of, of course, yourselves and your clients. So with all that being said, again, I apologize for going through so quickly. I think I have a few minutes for questions. I'm happy to speak offline as well, and thank you all very much.